What's going on guys, it's Big Tony here and today I'm going to be showing you 10 additions to improve your Minecraft house. So up first we have the greenhouse. A greenhouse is mainly a decorative addition, but it's also a great way to house some crops. I'd say it's a better alternative to blowing up your entire house just because you had a case of the munchies. Anyway, the construction is pretty simple, I just built up some oak log pillars with some glass in between, and then a roof made out of spruce stairs, slabs, and campfires. On the inside I placed some crops on the floor and then I made some shelves and tables with lots of plants and leaves and some other decorations. Feel free to experiment with the size and the design to make it fit with your house. Up next we have a chicken coop. This is just a little box made out of fences and fence gates with a campfire roof and filled with chickens. What's really nice is that you can pick up the eggs from the outside although you may have to go inside to breed them. For number 3 we have a storage addition, so it's basically just a little room that extends out by two blocks. I use the same roof shape as the main part of the house except it's one block lower and one block narrower. Since it's two blocks deep we have enough room to stack a ton of double chest sideways like this, making a lot of extra storage space. Also, number 3 comes with a bonus, it's another way to add some storage to a small house, and that is the shed. All it is is two double chests stacked on top of each other with two spruce trap doors on each side and two doors in front and then a roof made out of either slabs or campfires. For number 4 we have the outdoor workstation. So for this one I made a floor out of stone and some posts made of stone brick walls and fences to hold up a roof made out of slabs and trap doors. Inside you can place all of the crafting stations, furnaces or storage blocks that you need as well as some decorations. And number 5 is the back porch. To make this I just laid out a floor of spruce planks, I added some spruce fence posts with fence gate railings, and then I just continued the roof but at a less steep angle until it reached the fence posts. To decorate it I added a little bench here, a table with some flowers on it, and on the other side I made a little area for my dogs to sleep. For number 6 we have a tower. This one here is basically just a 5x5 square with the corners missing. And you can also keep the corners to make a square tower. I built it up a few blocks higher than the roof and then I made a railing out of fences and fence gates. And I used a fence post to hold up a pointy little roof. The main part of the tower is pretty simple but there's a lot of different tops you can try out and I'll show you two. For a castle -y vibe you can try out some crenellations. And if you're running low on space you can build a little house on top. Whatever you decide to do, I'm sure it's going to look great. For number 7 we have a balcony. It's really easy to construct, I just built up some logs with stone bricks in between, some stairs sticking out with trap doors in between, and then a fence and fence gate railing. This is mainly meant for a house with two floors, but if you really want to add a balcony you can just add a ladder or stairs leading up to it. Anyway, number 8 is the horse stables. There's a lot of ways you can do this, but for this one I just placed some stone brick walls with fence gates to keep the horses in, and then I used the same style of roof as I did for the main house and connected it. Also, I added another log next to the chimney just to make it symmetrical. Number 9 is mainly decorative, and it is a windmill. To make it, I built a 3x3 tower out of stone bricks, built it up a few blocks taller than the roof, and then I made this funky little spruce plank roof. Then towards the top of the tower I went out by two oak logs. Then on the end of that I placed a dark oak trapdoor. Then I made some blades out of oak logs, spruce stairs, and sandstone walls. I said it was mainly decorative, but it's not entirely useless. Since we have a 3x3, there's one block on the inside where you can place a ladder going up. And at the top you can make some windows out of spruce trapdoors. That way you can look around at your surroundings or shoot down at intruders. Our 10th and final addition is a giant furnace. As you can see I deleted the little chimney we had before because it's now completely irrelevant. So to build this it's basically just a big mound of stone bricks with the chimney going at the top. I made a little window using stone brick stairs and then inside we have magma blocks with campfires underneath to produce some smoke. Then on the inside I just filled up this wall where it's covered up by the chimney on the outside with furnaces. Alright, that concludes this video. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.